Hello everybody, and uh, welcome to a, the first episode of what I am guess I'm kind of calling The Ancients. Um, it's a new world that I'm creating where I create kind of like uh, in crazy uh, monuments or, or, or like high fantasy um, creations in creative mode and kind of do a little time lapse of it. So. Um, this first one is a giant tree house that is kind of in the middle of the dark wood area, as you can see right here where I'm at currently. And uh, you know what? Let's just let's just go ahead and start the time lapse, and uh, and we'll take a tour right afterwards. seen the time lapse let's go ahead and head right in and take a tour of the inside and see what the finished product now of course all you probably saw was the the tree being made but uh, here it is as you can see here we have a little path it comes in a little water nearby it looks pretty and uh, yeah and here we are god so uh, oh a little cow friend too um, yeah, I tried to make a bunch of flowers around it and, and grass and wild grass to really give it that overgrown look. Um, and a little platform to take you right up to the front here. And I wanted it to be like upwards on the trunk, so you really had to climb up almost that treehouse feel. Um, but this isn't no ordinary treehouse because normal treehouses, I think, you have a building outside of the tree, not you, <laughs> you carve the inside of the tree and make it the house so that's kind of what I did how's this tree still alive I don't know um, but yeah go ahead here and you can see here I have this kind of contraption here with these uh, um, oops anyway you saw nothing um, anyway yeah so uh, right here this is I kind of figured this is like a um, uh, a way where they collected uh, water as it rained or uh, maybe like collected sapling from the tree uh, and they would just come up here and, and grab it later on and then we come up here to the front door nice little front door and over here you have a nice little garden for them to attend to on the outside the goal of the thing also was to make this really cozy and just like this kind of you know relaxing atmosphere uh, just kind of living in the woods feeling so we go in and here it is, it's kind of dark a little bit. I didn't put a whole lot of light, but I wanted to be kind of, kind of low on heat. And uh, let me, I th all right, there we go. Put some meat for you so that way you can have some food while you're eating here. A little snack. We did some pork chops already pre-made. But yeah, so you get a little place to hang your hat here. A um, little kitchen area with your place to cook. Um, and of course, a little shaft that goes up and through the tree 
and uh, smoke smoke goes out the side of the tree so you don't burn the place. Uh, nice little packed area here at the ender chest, crafting bench, just kind of everything you can work on right here real quick. And of course I have this in case you know when 1.16 comes out and you can uh, make your nether, nether rack uh, armor and stuff. A little place to dine and um, yeah it's a, it's a nice little nice little area here of course is the door to get to the sapling or the water that you need to get to and down here is the basement down here we have your enchanting table place to have creepy uh, creeper head over here a little iron uh, I can't think of it uh, anvil and uh, here's your little mini storage uh, I know it's not the greatest storage it's not the the massive amount of storage you can possibly have but like when you have storage boxes everywhere um, up near the kitchen as well like I think this is doable and of course you can always expand into another tree outside of this one and uh, yeah uh, of course you have all your uh, nether wart here and you can craft some breweries here and another ender chest so you don't have to go up and down the uh, the, stick, the ladder if you need to grab something and that's it down here and there's a couple maps and everything I, I think it looks pretty good uh, pretty gorgeous I try to make this kind of like outer line indent down here which I think kind of added a little extra texture to the area and if we come up here and over here you see a stairway if you come up here you can see outside oh it's nighttime now ooh it's pretty uh, and up here is the second floor and you have your bedroom and here it's nice and cozy you got a little green carpet here with your green bed and you have a nice little view of the outside world here and you know what let's go ahead and go to sleep and uh... <laughs> and there you go there's a good morning um, sunrise view there I think it's pretty gorgeous a little mushrooms there as well and you place a little write your book here a little chest uh, some books another great view if you're sitting right here right in your book you know and you, and you want some you want some uh, inspiration and you see this gorgeous view with the vines coming down off the tree and it's just so gorgeous you know it inspires you to write your next uh, uh, greatest novel <laughs> and out here you come yes yeah, not this is not it out here you come to the back area the back deck where you have some more areas you can grab some water or some some uh, sapling and here's that chimney that comes out and the smoke comes out here I wanted to make sure there's no leaves that blocked it in case it caused fires ignore the the flying uh, piece of fire that comes out of there um, yeah alright and you come up here I want, like I said I wanted to make this like an ultimate survival uh, treehouse if I have not mentioned that before so like if there's one thing we haven't added to the space yet like you think just about everything is here uh, we have some plants here and some mushrooms that are overgrown. Get rid of that. And, uh, gosh, it's, just, it's also gorgeous up here if you look around. I even thought about like adding more out here, but you can climb up these branches and get a better view. Like, just, just take it in. And if you go up these stairs here, around the corner, you have your nether portal. A little chest here in case you want to store things before you head in. And uh, yeah, that I think is it for this. To end this off, um, if you if you want to see more builds like this, um, post in the comments below if you have any ideas. I already have a bunch of ideas for the ancient um, uh, series that I'm going to make. Uh, but if you want to check out the world yourself, check out check out the treehouse uh, yourself. I'll put the download link in the com in the um, description and the coordinates to get there because it is kind of far out there or I can just go ahead and show you uh, maybe there we go um, there's the coordinates to get there uh, in this world um, and you can check it out for yourself um, but that's it for me I hope you liked it and uh, yeah I'll see you all next time take care